Thank you, Fancy Farm, and it's good to be back. You know, it's always fun to come from the east where I live and come down here and visit with down-home folks. You've treated us good through the years, and I want to thank you for that. But it's a long way, and I want to share a little story with you. I got sidetracked. I lost my way. My GPS didn't work. I ended up in Jackson County. And I walked into a little country store there, and I told them I was lost. I wondered how to get back. They asked me who I was. I said, I'm Greg Stumbo. I'm a Democratic candidate for attorney general. The lady said, a Democrat. My gosh, we've never had a Democrat show up in this county before. Would you give us a speech? We'd like to hear what you have to say. And I said, well, I'd be honored to. So that she went out back and got some folks that were, lived out back behind the store and came back and... All they had there was a pile of horse manure, and they took a pallet, and they put it up on top of that horse manure. And I climbed up there, and I commenced to give my speech, and I said this, ladies and gentlemen, I said, I've given a lot of speeches at a lot of different places to a lot of different folks, but I've never given a Democratic speech from a Republican platform before. And that's what you just heard from Daniel Cameron. And I'm surprised... I'm surprised that Bevin showed up here today. Somebody told me he was, he was trying to find a crowd where at least 50% of them approved of his conduct. And then somebody said, well, the only place he'll do that is the family reunion up in New Hampshire. And thank God for Fancy Farm having this event once a year. It brings Mitch back from Russia and Daniel back from Washington so they can visit Kentucky for a while. But you know, 16 years ago, I stood on this stage and I made you some promises. And I kept those promises. I promised you I'd fight the opioid distributors and manufacturers that brought that poison into Kentucky, and we did. I was the first in the nation to sue Purdue Pharma. I promised you that we'd bring government to Western Kentucky, and I'd bring a branch office here, and I did, right up there at Benton, Kentucky, so you could have access to the Attorney General's office. I promised you that we ferret out public corruption, and we did. And we proved that even a governor is not above the law. I promised you that we'd create the Kentucky Bureau of Investigation to solve crimes, and we did, right here in Graves County. Joe Curran asked me on that day 16 years ago if I would help him find the criminals that killed his daughter. And I made a promise that I would. And guess what? We sent our KBI agents down here, and we did. And we'll create the KBI again because you've got the most corrupt administration under Matt Bevin that we've seen in Frankfurt and God knows how long in our history. His own challenger, his Republican friend, Robert Goldworth, Gorf, promised, said he, he stole $400 million from your pensions and gave it to his hedge fund buddies in New York, and that needs to be looked at. It needs to be investigated. All they want to do is elect somebody that won't uphold the law and won't investigate them. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to know this, and Daniel, you listen. The Attorney General's office is always open to the children. We love it when they come to see the office, and we explain what we do to them. But, Daniel, we don't let children run the thing. Thank you. God bless you. God bless Kentucky, and God bless the Constitution that gives us the right to come here today and be a part of such a great event. Thank you.